My name is Russell Gray. I'm the Director of Client Success here at Mixmo. I talk to Mixmo customers every day, and one of the biggest benefits that, that we hear from them time and time again is that they're getting new insights into what's happening in their network, in their environment that they never had before. And that's because of the, network, the nature of our network data that we're providing, which really does provide the sort of unvarnished, unmitigated truth of what's happening on your network. But then in addition to that, with the artificial intelligence layer that we have, we're able to give them anomaly detection and insight that they really can't get from any other tool on the market. Cybersecurity, there are so many points of input where customers are receiving endpoint, uh, inputs from a SIM, from an endpoint, from a firewall, from wire data, and they're having trouble sort of, how do they coalesce all of that together and turn that into action? Because at the end of the day, for them, it's not just about receiving information, it's about what can they do with that information. Mixbook provides visibility into network wire data, which was not typically uh, a standard within a, a cybersecurity stack. It really was a blind spot for most companies. And what's really satisfying is when customers deploy a mixed mode sensor, we sort of have this moment where they turn the lights on and they can actually see what's transgressing, what's traversing their network. Uh, we had released our first version of our artificial intelligence as a filter for our current security events. And very quickly, our customers, when digging into these events, uh, came up with the question of, well, can you give some insight into what the artificial intelligence is using to make its decision? So if it's determining that a given time period is anomalous or not, can you give some a level of clarity into that? We were able to give that feedback to the AI team and the engineering team, and this was surfaced into the product in a matter of about a month and a half. You know, we don't really know what the future will hold. And what I mean by that is our platform is very open it's very um, adaptable. We've recently come out with a new cloud trail sensor, which allows us, and that was a direct response to something that, that happened in the marketplace, where we saw another number of companies have their cloud trail data uh, be breached. And we realized that there's a large section of companies and customers that were not actually monitoring their cloud, AWS cloud trail from a security perspective. So we were able to build that into the product quite quickly. And that's an example of where we're able to sort of take the platform and adapt it to whatever the evolving threat landscape might be moving forward.